The Rhinelander is a rabbit breed with a medium-sized body. It is a domestic rabbit that has roots in Germany. It is known for its distinct facial markings like the famous butterfly mark. It also has unique marks on the spine, colored ears, eye circles, side marks, and cheek spots. The spots range from black, brown, and fawn colored. The Rhinelander is recognized by the American Rabbit Breeders Association ARBA and the British Rabbit Council or the BRC. The Rhinelander was first bred in Germany in the early 20th century. These were soon exported to other nearby countries during the 1920s. This is a popular breed in Germany, but the interest reduced in the 1930s because of the popularity of the checkered giant and the post-war effects of World War I. However, after World War II, the Rhinelander became more popular once more, and soon, it became very popular worldwide. In the United States, the popularity of the Rhinelander was on and off, especially its long absence from 1932 to 1972. The breed was again re-established in the US during the 1970s, and this resulted in the creation of the first Rhinelander breed club called the Rhinelander Rabbit Club of America in 1974. Today, the Rhinelander breed is rare in the United States and the UK. The Rhinelander is an arched breed meaning that when it is placed against a light source, the light will show between the body and the ground where the specimen is placed seated or moving. This appearance is similar to another arched breed known as the Checker Giant breed, but the Rhinelander is smaller. The Rhinelander has a trim and athletic look, with the body the same size from the rabbit's shoulders to the hip. It is very popular for its distinctive coat pattern and for its unique butterfly markings, which are seen over the nose and upper jaw. The shape of this mark looks like a butterfly. The BRC states that the weight of a Rhinelander should be from 6 to 10 pounds while the Arba says that the weight of this breed should be from 7 to 9 pounds. Coat and Colors When it comes to color markings, the BRC recognizes only a white base with black and yellow marks along the face and the back. Meanwhile, the Arba said that there is a blue and fawn spotting mark against a white background, aside from just the black and orange patterns. The Rhinelander coat is soft, short, and dense and won't need too much care to maintain. It should be brushed at least once a week and more often during the off-season during the shedding. This will remove any dry or straight hair. This rabbit will have two molting seasons in a year, and during this time, you must brush your rabbit using a slicker brush to keep it from shedding. Most pet owners are concerned about using hygiene products on their rabbits. Since you can't bathe your rabbit, how do you clean its fur thoroughly? The answer is an ingenious shampoo called a no water, no bathe shampoo. All you need to do is to wipe the shampoo on the fur of your pet and massage it gently. Afterward, wipe the shampoo with a damp cloth and then a dry cloth to remove any residue. As mentioned, never give your pet a bath. It is stressful and can even make your rabbit ill. History of the breed The Rhinelander rabbit was initially spotted in trade shows and events in 1902 in Germany after this was bred in North Rhine-Westphalia. Experts believe that his breed was made by combining the genes of a harlequin buck and a papillion doe. A buck from the litter possessed the marking that the Rhinelander breed will be famous for the celebrated black and orange in color on the chin, ears, and the butterfly mark on the nose. Still, another cross was made, but this time, it was with a harlequin buck and a large checker giant doe. The result was a litter with one doe that possessed the celebrated marks. The buck from the first litter and the doe from the second litter were mated, and the does from the resulting litter were mated with the harlequin bucks to preserve the Rhinelander breed. It was in 1905 when a standard was made to honor the Rhinelander in Germany. The breed was named Rhinis Scheck. The first Rhinelander rabbits were exported to the Netherlands and England in 1924. The new breed was a hit, but soon, people lost interest as well as the number of breeders who wanted to try the breed. Basically, the tedious selective breeding process and the required color combinations and markings were too much for breeders. In addition, Rhinelander was mainly bred for sport rather than for meat, and this made many people lose interest. By 1930, only a few breeders were able to preserve the process of breeding Rhinelander. After World War II, interest in the breed began to increase, it became one of the most popular spotted breeds in Germany in 1978. The first time Rhinelander was exported to the US from Germany was in 1923. It was soon recognized as a breed by the US National Breeders and Fanciers Association. By 1932, no Rhinelander remained in the U.S. because it was just too complicated to breed. Rabbit breeders also focused their attention on breeding the Checker Giant Rabbit. It was in 1932 when an American rabbit breeder visited Germany and saw the Rhinelander in a show and took with him four specimens from the country back to the U.S. In 1974, the Rhinelander Rabbit Club of America was founded, and a year later, the breed was recognized by the American Rabbit Breeders Association. 
Additional Rhinelander was imported to the Netherlands and Germany to deal with inbreeding among the limited number of Rhinelander in the US. There were breeders who crossed the Rhinelander with a checkered giant or a harlequin to preserve the breed. The American breed standard for the Rhinelander was rewritten and improved afterward the interest in the breed gradually improved. The Rhinelander is a part of a closely watched breed by the Livestock Conservancy. This means that there are less than 2,000 rabbits in the population and less than 200 registrations in the US yearly. The UK also recognized the urgency to protect the gradually decreasing population of Rhinelander. This breed is designed as a part of the BRC's Rare Varieties Club. Temperament and Behavior The Rhinelander is a docile and patient creature and thus will work best as a first-time pet for families, singles, seniors, and homes with children. These rabbits are cute, cuddly, and children won't be able to resist holding and hugging them. Of course, the Rhinelander won't mind. It can be the sole focus of the attention of a child in play. It will permit a child to tug its ears or holding it awkwardly because of its kind and gentle nature. Some say that the Rhinelander has earned this gentleness because of breeding and inbreeding. It was able to preserve its good looks and its many impressive natural qualities. It is soft, cuddly, and not as heavy as French lops or contus, therefore, a child can handle it with two hands. It will permit you to carry it and hold it in public and will always welcome a pat and even a kiss on top of its head. Allow a young Rhinelander to approach you without fear. Sit on the floor with him and hold a treat. Let it find your hand and bravely move towards you. The first time, it will be skittish and may not be trustful, but soon, it will see that you mean no harm, and you bring treats too. Do this regularly, and you can bet that your rabbit will trust you for life. As a Rhinelander is patient with its human family and its owner, it is also a good soul in a rabbit's cage. It will not pick fights or will never be aggressive with other rabbit pets. It will also be sociable and will gladly eat with other rabbits and even groom with them. Social grooming is said to strengthen the relationships of members of the group. In addition, there is no hierarchy in a Rhinelander's cage, and everyone has equal rights to the cage areas. A Rhinelander also has a laid-back attitude and being so, it is in danger of becoming overweight or obese. Eating too many calories and not moving much can make your rabbit fat. You can prevent this by playing with it, running, and playing tag with it inside its large enclosure. If you must take it out, make sure to rabbit-proof everything before you take the rabbit out of its cage. Most rabbits will love running and will gladly run to bond with their owners. Finally, Rhinelander is an easygoing rabbit and will always be happy to have company. Most Rhinelander owners say that they are glad to have this breed as a pet because this is easy to care for and won't be a problem when it comes to behavior and temperament. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.